where the ISDB-T system has been chosen as the digital terrestrial television technology. Spectrum mask measurements on transmitters are particularly demanding for spectrum analyzers. During the analog to digital transition phase, ISDB-T channels have to coexist adjacent to analog transmissions without causing any interference. The high rejection filtering used at the transmitter output means that the spectrum mask measurement demands in the ISDB-T specification are beyond the dynamic range capabilities of most spectrum analyzers. However, Enritsu handheld analyzers give you the ability to check whether transmitters are operating within the stringent spectrum mask demands. The Enritsu MS2712E, MS2713E Spectrum Masters and MT8212E Cell Master, configured with ISDBT signal analysis options, all have the capability to make spectrum mask measurements according to the ISDBT critical, subcritical, and non-critical mask specifications. By measuring first the unfiltered signal, the user can select a suitable output filter response curve to subtract from the measurement. Filter curves are easily defined using Enritsu's standard master software tools, PC software, and up to three different curves can be uploaded to the spectrum analyzer at any one time. During the measurement, a technician has complete flexibility on how to display and record the results to internal memory. So, however the transmitter is configured, he can show and save any combination of filter-corrected data, uncorrected data, and filter response together with the appropriate spectrum mask and immediately judge the transmitter's compliance. Until now, it has not been possible to make ISDBT digital television spectrum mask measurements with a handheld spectrum analyzer. With Enritsu's continuing lead in digital field testing, you now can.